about the 1822 House of Representatives Chamber, now the National Statuary Hall, by Samuel F. B. Morse, the same guy who invented the telegraph and developed Morse code. He chose to portray a night scene, balancing the architecture of the rotunda with the figures, and using lamplight to highlight the work. Pairs of people, those who stood alone, individuals bent over their desks working, were each painted simply but with faces of character. Morse chose nighttime to convey that Congress's dedication to the principles of democracy transcended day. Samuel began his formal school training at Phillips Academy when he was nine. At the age of 14, he entered Yale College. To earn money while in college, he began painting portraits, but he also liked to attend lectures on electricity. And this is the picture Samuel Morse painted of himself in 1812. In his earlier years, Morse made himself known as a portrait painter. But something else was driving him. It was a keen interest in inventing. And, in 1832, he developed a prototype for what was to become the telegraph. And, along with that, a code that used the telegraph to transmit information across long... In England, it was Wheatstone and Cook. With the memory of his wife always in mind, Morris stops painting and starts working on a device that will accelerate communication from the speed of the horse to the speed of light and foreshadows the digital revolution that drives the world today.